<sighs> well then guys, after the tragedies of last night, I think it's about time we start rebuilding. I'm gonna start by trying to get the upgraded Grok again. I'm also gonna be killing a lot of horror thingies for the jungle mask, and then I gotta get my Karazi boots and cape pack. Preferably, I'm starting to use Leaf Bat Bladed Battle Axe. I heard it's actually better than the Onyx Machete, so that in and of its own ain't the biggest lost, uh, loss, but I don't even have a fucking magic short bow yet. <laughs> I've opened a shitload of chests, but just not getting it for some reason. But uh, yeah, it's gonna be a little journey. I'm gonna have to spend some hours trying to get back to where we used to be, you know? It is what it is. Right, a few more hides. I would rather record it in case it goes successful. <laughs> Damn. Gonna be a while, but uh, actually, Goba has quite some items, so we're gonna yeet that off that account real quick. He told me uh, I could take it, because he never does Karazi anymore anyway. Um, he, As a matter of fact, he has Karazi boots, the Karazi cape, and the jungle mask, which are specifically the items I wanted. And he has an MSB I can take, so it's just a matter of, you know, regaining these superior ground heights, although I used to only have the body, but now I want both pieces rather than just the body. And, uh... We're pretty much back in action, kinda, more or less. It's just a very minimal amount of things that we need to reobtain after that. Looking forward to this. I'm gonna go meet up with uh, Mister, who's on Goba at the moment, so I can get that uh, get that stuff. All right, let's have a look. Cape, boots, MSB. Oh, he even has that bone key I gave yesterday, of course. Yeah, we're basically back where we used to be. Need to get some rune gloves, but that's just a random chest drop. Get the superior hides. That's about all I can think of for now at the moment. Right then, all together, um, pretty damn good upgrades. I'm really happy with it. This saves me literal hours upon hours. The Jungle Mask or Karazi Mask is really good as well. Plus 3 strength, ranged strength, great stats overall. Huge time save, I don't have to kill Jungle hours, uh, jungle Horror for hours and hours to get one of those fucking masks. It's literally just camping Grogs that might take a while. They don't have the highest drop rate. Oh, you always get a guaranteed hide, but then it's a matter of, you know, does it succeed when trying to upgrade the armor, which doesn't happen that often. You know, that's the, the rare part there. But even then, we got an MSB back, we just need to camp more rune arrows from chests, we have a bone key for when we want to start, some bonus blood money and trading sticks on top of it, so I'm pretty happy. Hey, my dudes, we finally got our first piece. We just upgraded the body, and this is like... Ooh, between 40 and 60 hides in. I've been here for a while, to say the least. But we finally got the first piece. Hunter, Grog stop. Can we get the legs right off the bat? How insane would that be? We cannot. Okay, so we're gonna have to hunt for a little bit longer. Oh my FG, I just got the legs! Yay! Ooh, I'm so happy, boys. Hunter's Grog's legs. Look at those stats. Two ranged strength, two regular strength. We're basically where we used to be. Maybe even fucking higher than we used to be? It's hard to say, but this is some fucking upgrades, boys. What shield? I used to have a dragon square instead of a granite shield, though. That's the biggest difference, but I could save up, um... Trading sticks for the jungle totem, which is 1500. So that's an option as well. My god, we did this extremely quick. Uh, I would say that one of the things that I need the most right now, at this current point in time, is more rune arrows so I can get back on the Nazistral grind. So basically what I'm doing right now is just, you know, running laps over and over and over, looting all the chests I can find. Which is a lot because there don't seem to be any other people on the island right now, which is nice. But like, I swear to god, for the last 30 plus chests, I have not seen a single rune arrow drop. Like, none at all. All and that's like the one thing I need right now. I want to stack up like 600 again or whatever the fuck, so I can so it can last me a little while to say the least. But look at this, no rune arrows. None of the chests I open give them whatsoever. It's a little bit unlucky, but yeah, it's the one thing I'm missing to go back to the Nazastrul grind. So we have a lot of kills to go. Who knows when I'm finally gonna get that dome? All right, I think I have plenty of trading sticks now. Let's go head over to the Slayer Master and buy ourselves the Jungle Totem. By the way, I also killed two Jungle Demons for 22 rune arrows. And then I also got five Blood Diamonds, which I banked. I mean, probably gonna take that off the island when I'm leaving. But, um, you know, in case I ever wanna get the Blood Rapier upgrade. 
Right, so if you go over here, you need 25 sticks to enter it, trade it, and then here's the jungle tower. It provides poison and venom immunity when equipped, so that in and of its own is really good. It also costs 250 slayer points, so keep that in mind. Now look at these stats. 5 strength bonus, 5 ranged strength bonus, not the best defensive bonuses, but reasonable 10 in every. Huge accuracy bonuses, like massive. It's such a good item, so we're definitely gonna spend on it. Fuck the granite shield, get the fuck out of my inventory. And then of course you also have the... What? <laughs> I didn't even know you could do that. But um, basically, these two are basically, if you get a Fizzage from Wyverns or the uh, Jungle Dragons, I guess, drop it as well. But small chance, but if you manage to get one, obviously, you want to get yourself that DFS. It's a really good item to have on the island as well. But yeah, we're looking pretty dummy thick. Wish I had room gloves already, but I'm going to be leaving anyway, and you can't store those. So, yeah, what else do I need? Probably just more rune arrows for now. I want to stack up Hella so we can uh, instantly jump on Nazistral the next time I come here. I'm going to be leaving in between either way because of the... Uh, what? It's definitely close, though. Because I um, want to use the elixirs and stuff again for the extra drop rate bonus and all of that good stuff. I think there might be someone around here because that drop wasn't mine and someone looted that chest. Ugh, someone is looting uh, out in here. That's not good. Alright, time to dip. I need to get something to eat and shit. But it is what we're looking like. I think we have upgraded from where we used to be before I got wiped, so to say. Didn't notice you can... Uh, no T's at first, but you totally can, so I'm stocking those up. Super combat spot even. I want to upgrade it further, but it's 3.5k, I think I've said that before, so we're gonna start saving up for that. 25 is the max capacity, so that's what we'll be aiming for here. But altogether, I'm pretty satisfied with where we are. It's just the rune arrow lacking, but since someone else is opening all the chests, I kind of CBA. Already have done a ton of laps, 530 or 553 trading sticks so far just from chests. I've opened easily over like 30 or 40 by now, and only 50 Runero so far, so I'm not getting too lucky. But I figured I would go ahead and buy a cursed casket, or even two, because we have quite a bit of blood money right now. Just wanted to see what we would get. Elixirs of Luck. On one hand, it's nice to have on the island, but on the other, a lesser blood or Okay. Hmm, starting to doubt my decision, because I kind of want like the Karazi Dagger or the fucking Battle Axe and shit. I mean... Imagine getting like a cursed blade or something, right? Yeah, crystal key. Hmm. Yeah, figured I would give it a shot anyway. And that is the last demonic gorilla for today. Big fucking sad life. We did not see a single fucking Xenite in 300 kills. It is what it is. Some dragon squares and shit though. But not what I was hoping for whatsoever. Not even some epics, or uh, some lucks shaking my head. Cool, cool, let's do some Skutizos. Oh, we got a Dark Horn, okay. Interesting. But yeah, it's, it's a good fucking show. And we're gonna roll that three times in one kill, and all three of them are the maximum amount, those four. And they're all doubled. Not asking for much here. <laughs> so just do it. All right, well, anyway. Weird shit aside, let's see how many we can do. We have 19, Jesus Christ, why 19? We're one short, technically six for all the rolls, but just one more shard would have given one extra roll. Grand Crest, let's see, what will it be? Number one. Ooh, okay, one out of one, yeah, I like seeing that, okay, okay, second. Ah, oh, Phil. Third. Okay. Let's go, let's fucking go, come on. Two out of three, hey, I like that. Oh, last one. Oh, three out of five, man. Let's fucking go, you'll love to see it. You'll love to see it. And we have, if we just had six more ancient shots, we could do another two attempts. But three crests out of five? Mwah, magnifique, lovely. That is so good. You'll love to see it. Ah, shit, here we go again. Oh my god, it happened, boys. It fucking happened, we got it. Oh my god, we got it. We got the Tomo Shadows. It's late at night, I gotta be quiet. 
Holy shit, we got it. No way. No way. 135kc. Let's fucking go, boys. I am so fucking stoked. Let's do one more kill for the back-to-back -back potential, but we actually got it as our first drop. I am so happy. Rune arrows were being a real pain in my ass. And we got it. We're done. I can leave. One more kill, and then I'm gone. Alright, back-to-back. No, okay, we're out. I am done. Goodbye, Karazi. For at least a little while. Don't get frozen as I teleport here. We're done, boys. Oh. It's 1 a.m. I can't really commentate too much, but this is so fucking good. All shadow spell damage by 33%. Let's have a little look at what we can do. Right, I quickly wanted to compare the max hit before and after, so before we were using Galvic Bat with this as max mage. We don't have the Encrestor top yet, but we'll come. 85.5% magic damage, 3rd age wand gives 27.5. Absolutely insane. Um, but yeah, just the top can be upgraded. Wait, hold up, I can take the Encrestor head as well, because we're not on Slayer Task anyway, right? So if we take... Big. Right, there we go. So, before and after. Before, if we used like block barrage, you could hit a 63 apparently. Still pretty good off task. You could definitely hit higher uh, on task. Yeah, I needed to get some air roots. <clears throat> okay, so let's see. With this, a 60. Okay, pretty decent. With the pet, a 64. And with the dome, an 84. <laughs> what? That's not even max max. What if I do this and then this? We can barrage 97s off task. What? On task with the Fuse Slayer Helm and with the Brimstone Slayer Staff. What? actually insane. 